Insights. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Lewis. I'm here to ask and answer one simple question. WTF, is this hut still doing here? Now, when I built this hut, I was going through a lot of emotions. I couldn't think straight. I was just a naive person. And this is the outcome of my poor choices. So today, we're going to give this hut the only special attention it's ever received in its life, and we're going to tear it down. So let's begin. Alright, while you guys are busy there, down in the comments, telling me off how I'm unoriginal, copying other people's intros, I was over here, breaking my back, actually doing some quality work here. So, if you guys don't mind, can you guys actually help me for once? Can you like, get down, get some, get an axe and help me? Here, here, I, I actually have an extra axe. There. Go ahead and take it. Please help me. Otherwise, why are you on this video? <laughs> I'm just playing, guys. I'm, I'm, I'm Lewis. It, nothing happened to me. Alright, so I actually started... I'm actually doing this. This is We're actually tearing this thing down. And we're going to build a house. An actual house that we can live in and uh, call our home. So, I'm going to get to it. I'm going to start uh, tearing this thing down by myself. My lonesome self. And I'll meet you guys on the other side. Bragga da down, bragga da down, bragga 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 da down, bragga da down, bragga da down, bragga 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 da down. Gonna break the pickaxe, huh? Break it on this one? No. How about this one? Break the pickaxe. What? All right, guys. Accuse me of having a short attention span, but I need to break this pickaxe. Because if I don't do it now, rather than later, I'm going to be really, really mad because you know that, you know that time when you only have one durability on your pickaxe, and then you mine it, and then you realize you have to craft another one? Well, I don't want that to happen, so here we go. This is the moment of truth. If we break this and we die, which is really likely then we're gonna spawn at spawn we're gonna have to travel like a 30 minute walk all the way over here because we can't run because you know when you die you don't you don't you don't spawn with food so this is like the biggest risk I've ever taken in my life but I'm gonna do it because that's what men do because why not Alright guys, since I'm really terrible at recording at the worst times, I'm hungry. So I'm going to get something to eat. Meanwhile, you guys can glorify in a awesome waterfall time lapse of nothingness. Yeah, enough of that nonsense. This is so morally wrong on so many levels. That'll be our little secret. Nothing's down there. Alright, so we have a problem. What defines the line between our special place here and our house? 
maybe that line but the problem with making a line is that if we do get this up and going making it look beautiful we'd actually have to start extending into here but I think that'll be fun because if we do that then we can actually extend with the uh, build on the terrain instead of terraforming and all that stuff it always makes things look beautiful in my honest opinion at least alright guys I have a confession to make when I build especially houses I don't build them decorative I build logically this is always the way I've been building in Minecraft as you can see here there's barely any decoration it's just the the size I like I like pretty much macro building the difference between macro and micro building micro building I consider is decorating like flowers all that stuff my macro building is pretty much the big stuff the room size uh, the patterns on the walls these big massive walls because that's the only thing I'm good at so if you don't like how the house is going to turn out don't get me wrong I am going to try to make it as good looking as possible because it is my house well you can shut your face cuz I'm just playing no just 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 be quiet please I don't have anything else than my house special thanks to windwater06 for changing the time today when it turns night cuz she's the only reason why you guys can actually see this path's not gonna work for us alright guys welcome back to building with Lewis double O seven that's right I am an agent here on the scene of the crime scene of the project crime seems as though we have a lot of chopped bodies here it's all kinds of alien blood on the ground all pixelated and all that what is this oh oh alright so I just figured out that whoever was chopping these bodies off just oh, chopped up the pieces and made them into who would build with this you seen cut right now alright we have a problem see this is where I want to put my pillar the problem here is that it'll look too big. Let me demonstrate like that. Just pretend that it goes there. I don't want to chop it back down or whatever. But look at this. If you have a wall like this, and you separate it with a pillar like this, it's too thick. This pillar is too thick. We want to only use one because that'll that'll look good. Let me demonstrate. See this? This is the kind of border we want. Look. The problem with my build is that I didn't measure anything. The problem with not measuring anything is because you start getting measured and it's wrong. Measurements. I can never I can never pronounce a lot of words. So forgive me if you ever hear me mispronounce any words because I slur my words. Do you see that? I slur my words a lot. Deal with it. Anyway, see this measurement here? This is an even number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, this is this is odd. That's odd. That's good. That's oddly good. But here, this is an even number. And this is an even number. I don't know what I'm thinking. Alright, one more thing on the subject. See these stone bricks? How I had to move it. I'm moving over here so I had to break all of them. You know when I fixed my pickaxe earlier in this video? I would have broke my pickaxe on that. And you know how frustrated I sounded back uh, five seconds ago? Yeah. I would have elevated to throw the controller at the screen frustrated. And you don't want to see that. That's why you always plan ahead. Alright guys, we are making some progress here. I still don't, I don't know why, why it's like that. Anyway. So I got the ceiling done, I got the rooftop done, it sloped kind of like that, and uh, we just need to install a floor here. Gonna use basic wood, I think, maybe. Um, and then install the windows, obviously, and then uh, we'll be set. 
uh, maybe a little decoration here and there I'll put my bed in here this is the bedroom that's the living room or whatever um, and I uh, will be set so we'll see you in the next update two hours later alright guys I finished the project is complete transaction complete the package has completed it's arrived here in its full form house format I hope you guys are excited to see this as I was excited to build it I guess I want to I want to I want to make a cool phrase for you guys to leave off of anyway but the house is finished except for the little parts I want to put in obviously I got to move these chests back in there uh, add some kitchen appliances all that good stuff but anyway let's do the big reveal shall we one two three let's go that was terrible terrible camera work there cameraman but here we are there's the house the house that you've been waiting for this entire hour and a half long episode yes here it is now some of you may be asking me does that look a little different from the previous frame and to you I say Good sir, you are very observant. Observant. I don't know what I said there. Yes, there have been little minor changes. I started out with the template and I built off of it. That's the thing with templates, they're not the final form. Let's go inside. Nice open room here. We got a nice big bedroom. We got a nice big kitchen. We got a nice big bathroom it's pretty much a whole package all in one room isn't that the dream home but yes I still gotta move some some stuff in here I gotta yeah I already set my spawn but that's pretty much the finished product here let me give you a 3d 360 degree turn around the house it's completely unnecessary because it's pretty much symmetrical it only requires 180 anyway that's pretty much all for the project for today and it just started raining ah <sighs> okay let's just uh, end this episode with a good note and uh, as I said in the previous episode whenever we end an episode we're going to add a touch here so I have not prepared for this what shall we do here uh, let's plant two trees <laughs> there I escaped I escaped the the bond you have with me I am no longer under your ruling now because I am adding to it there we have two trees planted uh, maybe you want to add some more flowers. Let's do that here. Man, I really wish it wouldn't rain though, because that might completely mess this up. Oh well. I know you guys don't want to see me complain. But, there we go. We have it right here. Voila. You guys are satisfied, no? Well, I'm completely satisfied. I don't know about you guys, but this is my channel. I can do whatever I want, okay? Okay, you got that in your minds? Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright, but that's pretty much it. That's, that's all I'm going to build today. So, without further ado, I'll see you later. if we extend it a little bit yeah we're gonna extend it a little bit so put slabs right here and uh we're only gonna have